it's Jem here. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. I know I am, and my day is just about to get even more exciting. I just received a new package from a company called Bog Street. Now, Bog Street are a fairly new company that makes guitar accessories like guitar picks, guitar strings, shirts, stickers. But not only do they make guitar picks, they make their own original designs of guitar picks. And what their focus is, is they want to reinvent the guitar pick to improve the player experience. Andrew from Bog Street DM'd me on Instagram and he very graciously asked if I'd like to try some of their products. So I received this package from Andrew. I don't know what's inside, but I'm really excited to unbox this thing. I'm excited to try out what's inside here, especially the guitar picks if, you know, if it's more than just guitar picks. And yeah, this is going to be really awesome. I'm always into gear that is trying to innovate and move music forward and help whatever it is that the musician is trying to do in creating music. So let's unbox this thing and see how it goes, shall we? Oh, this is awesome. All right. So check this out. I got a Bog Street mix pack of premium, premium, premium plectrums. <laughs> oh, oh, take a look at that, bogstreet.com. There's their Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook handle at Bog Street. That's awesome. What else is in here? Oh my gosh. Oh, got some Bog Street guitar strings. Oh, this is awesome. 1046 bright light. Yep, hex core nickel wound. Cool. Check that out. What else is inside here? Oh, also got some Bog Street stickers. Ha! <laughs> this is awesome. Right, another sticker. Great. It's awesome. So I got a pack of picks, some stickers, and a packet of guitar strings. How awesome. Now, by no means am I getting paid by Bog Street to do any of this. This is just literally an unboxing video and a review that I want to do just because I'm always interested in trying out gear. So I'm always excited about new gear. I'm always excited about products that help me create music. And yeah, this is really cool. Let's test out these Bog Street picks, shall we? Now, the guitar picks I've been using throughout majority of the time I've been playing, especially electric guitar, have been Dunlop picks, whether it's the Tortex or the Jazz 3, whether it's this green one, the purple one. I just like using thicker picks in general. I, I like using thicker picks in general. And the Dunlop Tortex picks have always been the ones that I felt most comfortable with. But when I play acoustic guitar, I like using the more thinner picks because they just help me play acoustic a little more easier. Now let's see what's inside this Bog Street mix pack, hey? Whoa, all right. So, okay, huh. Right, so here are the different kinds of picks that you get in here. They all have different thicknesses. Whoa, that is cool, different grooves of the pick. Here you have the lead series, so I'm guessing that's these big white ones. The axe cut. Oh, look at that. That is awesome. The axe cut, the axe blade, the battle axe, and the mini beast. Let's open it up and see what's inside. Wow, this is a really, really awesome uh, packet of goodies here. All right, so, wow. Jeez. This is a very gracious sample pack. Check this out. Oh. Whoa, okay. Just so many. Look, you got these things. I'm guessing that's the... These are the lead series, I'm guessing? Right. Lead and rhythm. Lead and rhythm series. The, these two big ones. You got a smaller one. I'm guessing this is like more of a Jazz 3 type pick. This is the Mini Beast. <laughs> awesome. Jeez, so many things to, to try. Out. I, don't, I don't know what I, where I want to start. <laughs> Yeah, I'll try this one. I'll try this one. I, I don't know. I don't know what this one is. It doesn't really say which model it is on the pick, but so far I like the size of it. it feels really cool. Really, really different. Um, it's got these uh, grooves on them, textured grooves on them. If you can hear it, and I'm guessing not only does that help with grip, but when it tacks the strings, I'm guessing it gives a different tonality to the. The, the tone of the guitar, so, oh, right. Right, okay. Feels, feels really comfortable.
most comfortable even when I hybrid pick. Really nice, really comfortable to play with. It's really interesting when you place your fingers in the middle of the pick. It's like you can feel your fingers because it's going through the hole. Um, it's interesting, it's definitely something new. Let's try, I don't know, let's try this smaller one. This, uh, I guess the mini beast. Let's try this. <laughs> This has a much brighter tonality and a harder attack when I hit the strings. Oh, now, oh, trying to find because there are three sides. Trying to find which which side is the most comfortable. Oh, all right. Now this one, you really got to be precise with your picking. This one acts like a like a jazz three, uh, only it it you got to be really precise with the way you pick this thing because your strings can get caught up. Your strings can get caught up in these grooves over here. Now I want to try one of the thinner ones uh, with an acoustic guitar and see how that goes. So I've got this the Leap series, um, three different thicknesses to it, and I've also got this. Thinner one here, this blue one. So, see how this one feels. You know, even it's big. I don't feel like it's like really bulky when I'm when I'm strumming or when I'm picking. Feels really comfortable actually. This is like the most comfortable like three-way pick I've ever played. Really great. Uh, let's try this blue one. Yeah, just inside. Yeah, I can vibe with this one when I'm playing acoustic. I know when I'm playing a long set, this isn't gonna hurt my hands like other picks usually do. So, so far what I'm getting with these picks and the way that they feel and how they attack the strings definitely takes a bit of getting used to compared to something like this, but not a whole ton of adjustments. Uh, it really feels... It feels super sturdy. It feels quite comfortable. <laughs> It's just very different to the touch because, especially with this hole, you feel your finger go through, you know, the hole. And it's like you're not used to feeling your your fingers touch when you're playing with the plectrum. So it's comfortable. It, it definitely uh, is a different feel to it. But I really like the way that I'm able to attack the strings with these things. <laughs> Even when I'm strumming, I feel like I can grip these picks better than I would with a traditional pick like this. So my final thoughts on these products, these Bog Street picks, I think they're fantastic. I really like the idea of reinventing the plectrum. I like the idea of coming up with different designs, different thicknesses, and just a new uh, identifiable shape. Uh, not only in a branding sense, but you know, you can recognize that these picks are Bog Street picks because of the way they're designed, you know, how can you not realize that the pick with a hole is designed by the company Bog Street, so that is really cool. I, I, I like this, this is really cool, I like the way how they're pushing the plectrum forward because, you know, picks are quite important when you play guitar. I don't know if you guys know this, but like different picks affect the way that you play, they affect the way that you sound, they affect the way that you're confident on the notes that you play, whether you're you know, playing fast or playing slow, if you're playing hard or softer, you know. Your guitar pick is like another piece of your instrument and it's really important, so I really like this. I'm very grateful to Andrew and the team over at Bog Street for sending 
these wonderful gifts of picks and strings and stickers. Like, jeez, this is really, really generous of you guys. If you guys get a chance to play Bog Street Picks, I suggest go try it out because these things are quite awesome. They're really good and I think I might use these quite a lot. I like them. I really do like them. I'm, be I'm being honest. Uh, I'm not saying these things just to try and be nice. You know, it does get a bit of getting used to. If I were to change anything with the picks, is it, I would just change, uh, or add, sorry, I would add what uh, model of pick I'm playing when I pick up one of these things because I can't tell if I'm playing an axe card, an axe blade, a battle axe. Um, because, you know, when you see these things for the first time, you think they all look the same, but um, they're not the same. So it would be nice if they added, you know, a battle axe model on the plectrum or, you know, whatever model it is based on this. So, yeah! I really like this. This is a fantastic product. Really, really cool. Really, really innovative in my opinion. I think it's brilliant. And I like how they're pushing the plectrum forward. So, go check out Bog Street. Thank you to Andrew and team for sending these wonderful gifts over. I'm very grateful for you guys. Keep up the hard work. And go and play some Bog Street stuff. Peace out.